one with nature that's just about the perfect description i can give to these gorgeous headphones this is a masterful creation from a rather small company with a strong focus on design and quality they were founded in 2009 and just recently i would say they have pretty much unleashed the cannons and crafted a legend this little company goes by the name of maze and this work of art that i am holding is a 99 classics the box screams premium with even the frequency response printed on it as well as a gorgeous shot of the headphone and its various features and speculations. Nothing is too flashy and everything remains professionally clean with just an effectively placed review headline from PC Mag to help push the consumer who's probably holding the box at a retail store into purchasing it. Once the lid has been opened, you are greeted with the 99 Classics case, warranty and quick guide paperwork and moisture reducing silica gel. The case is rather huge, immediately making it obvious that these do not fold or collapse in upon itself. Within the case is the 99 Classics and another little case that pretty much holds the standard 4 feet portable cable with a single button inline microphone that allows you to manipulate song skips and phone calls. The second cable is a basic 10 feet cable without an inline microphone, suitable more for home or studio use. You also get a quarter inch to one eighth inch adapter for use with more powerful sources and a stereo to mono one eighth inch adapter for use in airlines. The construction quality on the 99 Classics are superb with real walnut wood leather used to form plush ear pads that wrap around most ears. However, the depth is a bit shallow but doesn't cause me any discomfort. The headband is a genius hammock design that seamlessly adjusts to your head as you put them on. I have no faults for this headphone's physical attributes as it's pretty much very functional while being simply a beauty to behold. Now for the sound. These are insanely balanced and organic sounding headphones with no real emphasis on a particular frequency response. Now, these are not neutral on paper as in a flat line from left to right as what is shown in the packaging box, but neutral to the ears. Now, when neutrality to the ears are accomplished, what is produced is an organic and simply true-to-life sound that just clicks with your senses instantly because it mimics what we perceive on a daily basis. The bass presentation here is slightly accentuated to give more drive and presence in the impact and slam of the notes, but it's tuned in such a way that it's mostly linear and doesn't interfere with the other frequencies. It's a healthy amount of bass with good extension into the lowest of the sub bass regions. However, the bass isn't quite up there with my best headphones and IEMs in terms of the solidity of its composure and overall tightness. It tends to sound a tad loose when things get complex down low, but this can actually give a bloom effect to it, which might be beneficial to some recordings depending on the user, but I myself prefer a more focused bass. The mid-range is simply the star of the show here for me. Incredibly organic and simply just natural in its rendition. It's pretty much jaw-dropping to experience. Voices and instruments sound very clear with just the right amount of weight and distance which really pulls you into the recording and leaves you dazed. Easily, this is among the best sounding mid-range performances that I I've heard from a headphone or IEM and possibly the best I have heard from a headphone that you can take outside. The treble is nicely articulated in terms of having that satisfying bite without being overly piercing resulting in an offensive tone in the upper registers. The extension is decent, but I feel that the rolled off upper treble helps give it that natural tone to the overall sound. In terms of the quality, while the mid-range is relatively clear and grainless, the treble for me would benefit from a tad bit more refinement, but it isn't very noticeable until you've heard some of the top-of-the-line headphones and IEMs and pretty much experienced a grainless smooth treble. The image in here is quite nice, and the sense of space is simply spectacular for a closed-back headphone. This is simply one lively, dynamic, and punchy sound that has lots of space to play around with, and it gets very loud quite easily from a portable source. What more can I honestly say here? If you're in the market for a stunning looking headphone with an organic, rich, and energetic sound, the 99 Classics should simply be at the top of your list. Thanks for watching my video review. Later.